I feel good about how I did. I, I, I don't know. I mean, we'll see. But it seemed like that I was ahead of a lot of people during this race. Thank 
feel it. Come on, bring it. We didn't get this far to let that slow us down. Good rhythm. Good start. Good pace. 45 seconds in. First turn. Oh, I'd love it to be on the nine. Yeah, it's a fast runner. Good. Good. Make me hungry, dude. Come on. Yeah, he's moving. Motivation right there. He's going to pull me a little bit out of my comfort zone. Good. Good. Let's stretch, baby. All right, Mary. Hey. Hey. Thank you. Thank you. Eight twenty two. Eight twenty two. All right. Got something good working. Stay on it. Got some hungry runners on your heels, man. All right, so how was the swim start, man? Well, you know, honestly, I uh, think it got a little bit inside of my own head. So uh, the water was, I said, 76 or so, 77 degrees. So that's not cold, but for some reason, I don't know why, it felt a little bit cool for me. Um, and I think I might have started out fast, so I kind of had to slow down a little bit and try and collect myself. But once I turned on the buoy, um, whew, I started to like just move, man. Pick up the speed. Yeah, it was, you know, according to my watch, of course, you know, the time is going to be different because it's when you cross the, the, the timing mat. But I had 847. Now, I think there was a little bit of a current, but nonetheless, we'll see how that ranks. But I, I feel good about it. Big swole was roll. <laughs> yeah, man. So uh, how's that? How's that run going for you? I uh, felt good. Um, cooler weather and so forth, and I uh, picked up a couple of motivators, people who were, you know, really moving, people who passed me. It made me kind of pick up my pace a little bit, you know, just because, well, one, I, I mean, you know, whether you catch them or not is what's, what's important is, is it going to help you? And it did. Uh, I picked up my pace. I ran 822 on the first, and I think I did like, look, I wanted to do a sub nine minute per mile pace, and I think I did that. I think I did like eight. 
20 or something, probably less than that. But I was very pleased with the run, very pleased with it. And I mean, yeah. you got to think, you got to factor on a bike, you know. Uh, you get off the bike, that's a good pace, so. The bike was in your wheelhouse. How was that going? Uh, going out, man, I, I, according to my clock, I was at 21 at the turnaround. But um, lit, I wouldn't say headwind. I, there's a couple little, maybe sidewind, maybe a little bit a couple times. But I uh, ended up getting, I think, 20.8 for the distance that my clock showed. Um, but it felt good. Uh, I only got passed by, I think, three people, which isn't bad. And I passed up quite a few. Um, so, yeah, I feel good about it, man. I, I, I feel good about how I did. I, I, I don't know. I mean, we'll see. But it seemed like I was ahead of a lot of people during this race. So I don't know if that's any indication, but I feel good. So and it's it was a great weather for it. We'll, you got it done. Yeah, man. We, we're 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 gonna we're gonna recover today, and then we'll uh, we'll come back and do it again tomorrow, man. 56 miles, 1.2 for you. Yeah, man. 1.2, man. It's yeah. it's it's done, man. It's, it's all about it, just showing it up. It ain't a cakewalk. It. It's okay, man. You, you gotta you know, get in your rhythm. Like, you know. That, that that's the thing about it. You can train all you want, but and it helps. But there's nothing. There's no there's no feeling like showing up and seeing what you can do. Right. Better not be a that's current. That's the mystery. Here. I mean, you can train, but you until you do it, you really don't know. And I think that makes it exciting because the, the, there's the prospect of doing something that maybe you thought you couldn't do. That's right. Well yeah. said. Got to have that hands-on, real-life, racing experience, not just yeah, the training. Man. Training only take you so far, but you know you gotta gotta be in a race to, race to find out yeah. how it goes. It was great today, man. It was good seeing you as well. All right, Evan. So, how how was the race? Oh man, it was fun. I started out on the swim. The swim was right in my eyes going out, and uh, it was hard to pace. I couldn't sight very well. Yeah. I came back. It was it was better. I did more. I'm crawling than I thought I would be, which is awesome. Yeah. So I did pretty well on the swim and in the bike, just doing what I do. What was your average? Doing what I do. I had 22 on my clock. Yeah. Doing what I 10.82 miles. So it yeah, over it's 10. 22. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, I was just in my wheelhouse, man. You know, yeah. Just like I was bridging gaps, man. Flying by people left and right. I was like the flash. And on the run, man, it's the first time I felt comfortable on a run. Yeah. The race long time yeah and uh yeah i just powered through it good just one you know, 114 total yeah time. total time yeah so later we'll we'll see what your chip time is and we'll we'll post it but yeah. uh chances are i think you did really well regardless uh but i i i, I think you placed uh, and if you didn't that bike is going to be definitely top it's going to be top percentile i can i can assure well, you that I'll tell you, when i came back on a bike man like i said in transition no, there was like no hardly any bikes wrapped. Yeah. So that tells me that everybody was still on the course. Yeah. Terrible. Yeah, well. But it's it your first one in a while. Fun. Yeah. yeah. First, first race in six months. Yeah. First race since COVID, man. Yeah. Well, congratulations, yeah, and uh, we'll uh, we'll see you tomorrow, man. Appreciate it, man. We're gonna crush it tomorrow. Yeah. Sure. All right. Maybe